everyone. Good morning. So I'm back on my walking grind. I stopped for about a week because I wasn't really feeling too great, but I'm back, back at it again, doing my 10,000 steps a day to try and stay happy and sane and relatively healthy. No makeup, looking all right. I mean, I still look dead, but I don't look horrible. My skin doesn't look terrible. Also, this is like my actual face now because all of my Botox has faded away. So this is how your girl looks, forehead wrinkles and all. It's so crazy how just in a matter of a couple of weeks, the woods here have completely changed. Like two weeks ago, things were not in bloom. Now it's like a jungle out here. So, I am going to do some curbside pickup today, which is like my new favorite thing because it gets me out of the house and I get to go get something and I don't have to wait for Amazon to ship it. <sighs> so today I'm doing curbside pickup makeup. Got a bunch of stuff that I really need. I got my mom something that she really needed and I'm gonna drive like 30 minutes because I guess that's like the closest Ulta that will do curbside pickup. So I'm gonna go do that. Uh, but yeah, today's been actually pretty productive. I napped. <laughs> you know, some days are just a nap day. Some days you just don't do anything. You nap and you do the minimum amount of work necessary and that's okay. You don't beat yourself up over it because that's what I used to do. Like any day that I wasn't at like 100% like doing everything that I needed to get done. If I wasn't doing that, then I was a fucking failure. But no, today, you know, and it's Saturday. That's all good. No worries. We just napped all day instead. I don't <laughs> I look kind of crazy. Thank you. Okay. Thanks. This is not a good look right now for me. I feel like I'm like part of the team that went into Chernobyl to clean shit. Anyway, I'm out in civilization. I just saw like another human being. That was pretty fucking cool, I guess. I haven't done that in a while. I wonder how like legit this is. Am I even wearing this properly? This is from my family in Czech Republic. My uncle owns a factory in Czech Republic and I guess this is what his factory workers use. So he sent a bunch to our family to use, so. Now we get them. Cool. This is like legit as fuck, right? Like I feel like Bane. I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Okay, I am back home from Ulta. So I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up. First thing, I've never heard of this before. I just literally put in masks on Ulta.com and just picked whatever looked the coolest and had the best ratings. This is Florence by Mills and it's a peel off mask duo. And I love the packaging. It's this pink and lavender color. Okay, so one's like a calming and one's like an energizing. Interesting, very cool. Maybe I will do one tonight. Then I got my tried and true daily moisturizer. I got this one in the biggest size. I actually had it in a small, wow, this is gigantic. This is huge, yay, I'm so excited. This is the best daily moisturizer you can get. Like, I've tried so many, this takes the cake. Then I got some Moroccan argan oil, and I guess this is just like an argan oil spray for your hair. As you guys know, I've lightened my hair recently, so I just figured I could use a little boost to my hair. And then I got Clinique Happy Heart. I wanted a new perfume. I don't know how this smells even. Let's see, I've been on such a Clinique kick lately that I just feel like I'm gonna like everything by Clinique. Ah, ooh, okay, very, very simple. Oh, wow, yeah, that's a really nice scent. It's very floral, fresh. Then I got the Beyond Mascara from Benefit, and then I got two more things. I got my Clinique foundation. This is my go-to foundation. Really great, not like super full coverage, it's like sheer. I just like the way it looks on my skin. It doesn't like build up and look cakey. And then I got the Mario Badescu Super Collagen Mask. I've seen a lot of different YouTubers use this. So yeah, I am excited to try out some of these things. I really just, I don't know, I needed some masks. I wanted to try new stuff on my face. 
so I have those two peel off masks and I have the collagen masks so I'll definitely be trying those out probably tonight actually I'm feeling like I want to do a face mask so I'm gonna do a little bit of a face mask and I'm gonna take a shower I'm gonna turn the shower on because I want to take a nice steamy shower and I'm gonna do the face mask while I'm in the shower that way I can wash it off and while the mask is setting and doing its magic I can I don't know just stand there and ponder my existence okay gonna use water to wash off makeup I hate that whenever I wipe my face so it gets so red Welcome to my shower. It's pretty hot in here. <laughs> so I'm just giving you guys some of my essentials in the shower that I've just started using or been using for a little while and I really like. So this was recommended to me by a bunch of my Instagram followers. I've been on quite a hair journey the past month and my hair was looking really orange and brassy because I tried to go blonde and it didn't quite work out. Story of every wannabe quarantine blonde life right now. Um, so I got the Fanola No Orange Shampoo. Apparently, this is what I've learned from my followers who know more than I do. Um, purple shampoo cancels out yellow tones. Blue shampoo cancels out orange tones. And I gotta say, I've used this twice already. It's amazing. It removed so much of the brassiness, so it's definitely a more cool, natural blonde shade. I do also have the Shimmer Lights Purple Shampoo. Not a huge fan of this. I think it's pretty overrated. Uh, something that I've recently started using that's amazing is this Aussie Miracle Moist Conditioner. I love this big pump bottle. I use a ton of it, and it's made with avocado and Australian jojoba oil. I don't know if I said that right. It's so moisturizing. If you have color treated hair, if you have dry, brittle hair, try this. I literally pump so much into my hand and I just like lather it in. I let it sit on my hair for like 20 minutes while I shower and it's amazing. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> I mean, I just use like regular soap. I don't use anything fancy right now because I'm quarantining with my parents. So all of my like, soaps that I like are back in my apartment in New York. But yep, I've just been using this Olay Ultra Moisture Body Wash. But yeah, I'm gonna go take my shower. Yay! I'm in, I'm in the shower, I'm showering. <laughs> How was your day, guys? Did you have a good day? I had a good day. I was kind of feeling, I don't know, a little bit crabby, kind of sad. So then I went for a drive and I picked up my stuff at Ulta and I saw that other people were out and I was like, you know what, it's not the end of the world. It's just things are a little different right now. I saw in the news today, it was like breaking news, people are feeling more anxious lately and I'm like, no shit, really, you wouldn't say. Anybody who's not experiencing anxiety right now, I think you need to go see a therapist. <laughs> just kidding, if you can handle it, good for you. All right, I'm gonna go finish up the shower. I'll catch you guys in a bit. This is like my favorite part of the day. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's like heaven. Whew, okay, I feel great. I will be completely honest with you guys. I actually poured myself a bowl of potato chips. I don't really want them anymore. <laughs> like I feel so healthy and fresh that I almost feel like putting these potato chips into my body is gonna make me feel disgusting but i'm gonna have a couple and then i'm gonna put them away and maybe i'm just gonna like have a sparkling water they are good mm -hmm. okay one more one more potato chip <laughs> 